Hey, welcome back. So yesterday I had some uh, topsoil delivered. I'm going to get this spread out over here in the backyard and get it all kind of level as much as I can. One area I need to bring up quite a bit. Actually, two areas I need to bring up quite a bit and um, get this smoothed out and ready to go. Get some lime spread. And here in about a week and a half, be ready to seed. Uh, like I said yesterday, I had three yards delivered. I borrowed a buddy's tractor and got it kind of spread out roughly ahead of a little bit of rain we had overnight. And today I'm going to um, probably do that some more and do some hand leveling and picking the junk out of it and whatnot. But hold on just a minute. Okay, so the first thing I did here was I took the tractor and just back dragged the entire yard kind of figure out where the high spots and low spots were um i'm not very good with this tractor at all but it, it worked really well it's a lot easier than doing it all by hand and it, it quickly showed me where i needed to add a little more topsoil or where i needed to cut it down and it, it worked really effectively i was really glad to have that thing it made life really easy as you can see here and then when i got that done i grabbed a uh all the topsoil and had to fill in on this particular spot here it needed to come up nearly three inches that's why i chose not to use sand um that's actually here it was about three and a half inches and on the other side of the rv pad there was about two inches so that took quite a bit and then i just used what was left of the topsoil to fill in the uh, ankle breaking divots that were everywhere throughout the yard but this made pretty quick work of it um spread a little bit of it uh, out by hand every now and then with the level or a uh, landscaping rake and like I said it just made this very very easy and quick as you can see I wish I would have taken the time to sift all of this there was a lot of debris in it um, I wasn't very happy with what I got but uh, we did we did do a pick out like two or three five gallon buckets worth of rocks and trash and other stuff out of it uh, as my wife was helping me spread it out we both cleaned it out pretty well so I'm, I'm real happy with how it turned out it turned out pretty good as you can see the tractor makes it real easy to kind of quickly rough level things out and then after that we went back with the landscape rakes and pulled the high spots into the low spots and got it pretty good it's not perfect and then uh, while I had the time I know my pH is extremely low and I went ahead and spread out uh, about 100 pounds of lime and let water that in really well after we got that spread out and then um, from there we borrowed a roller to start rolling all this in thanks Matt by the way for that and um, that makes it real easy to kind of press down the, the clumps that were in the topsoil uh, help also show where the low spots are at All right, so I got about 100 pounds of lime spread out over this two, now 2,000 square feet. It used to be 1,500. When I'm done, it'll be 2,000. Um, this is a good time, like if you want to put down things like lime or egg soil, maybe any type of amendment. Now's a good time to do it. Kind of let it sit there. My plan is to basically water this in here in a minute, and then over the next several days, I'm going to water, rake, roll, water, just back forth, back forth deal with any weeds that might come up, pull any rocks out that I find, um, stuff like that. So here in a few days, hopefully it'll be ready to rock and roll. I can also be able to see with the water and if I still have some low spots. Um, I'm not too heavily concerned about that. The biggest thing was is I wanted the short, sharp divots that just throw the mower everywhere. I wanted those uh, leveled out and then bring up the two spots that were pretty low. But other than that, um, this is it, guys. Uh, Next step will be seeding, and uh, I'll bring all that to you here shortly. Stay tuned. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Hit the like button down below if you like what you saw today. And uh, we'll see you in the next video.